Fresh news of Mitsubishi's plans to resuscitate the Evolution name ought to be as welcome as an unlimited bar tab. But the latest concept looks set to stick rigidly to the manufacturer's current self-hybrid game plan, and a wide world away from the anything previously branded with a Roman numeral. Any excuse, right? The Evolution, previewed by the firm in a single picture ahead of the Tokyo show next month, reveals precisely the same kind of swept-back crossover that the world and his dog has sitting on a drawing board or rolling from a production line. It'll have for wheel driven an electric powertrain. It is calculated in production format, at any rate to help return Mitsubishi to sustainable growth. That's fine, of course. Car makers are under no obligation to build anything which they can't sell, and the firm's SUV heritage is plenty deep enough for it to launch a flagship in the modern vogue. But the unabashed application of the Evo name seems a wee bit cynical from the where we sit, if only because ten generations of Lancer left such an indelible and distinctive impression. Granted, a model in that mold saloon-shaped, savagely powerful and acutely determined to drive is now as good as impossible for Mitsubishi to build not least, because the Lancer is no more safe for a ghostly ongoing presence in China. Still, on balance, I'd prefer the fading misty memories made aboard a Tommy Mackin in addition on a wet roundabout to having the Evolution legacy sullied with an ungainly EE.